A hurricane is coming to the north central Gulf Coast this weekend. Tropical force winds, tropical storm force winds are possible over the western part of our area. We won't have a sustained tropical storm force winds, but there could be a few gusts up there. Tropical downpour certainly and also the potential for a few spin up tornadoes, especially over the western half of the area. Here's where the storm is now. Still a depression at this point. Peak winds. Nope. Just got an update from the Hurricane Hunter Plains. It is now Tropical Storm Ida. The plane has been in there for the last hour or so, found tropical storm force winds. We now have tropical storm Ida on its way to being a hurricane in a short period of time. There's the forecast track toward the northwest, as you can see, becoming a hurricane over the central Gulf Saturday, making landfall southeastern Louisiana Sunday afternoon as a category two hurricane with peak winds of 110, five miles per hour more, and it will be a major hurricane. So this is a significant storm coming to the Gulf Coast this weekend. The worst impacts will be here, Louisiana, but there'll be significant impacts on the Mississippi coast and impacts for our coast too. I could see two to three feet storm surge, for example, in Mobile and Baldwin counties, Dolphin Island probably getting plenty of overwash. By Wednesday, the system is exiting the area and headed up to the northeast. Forecast rain totals with this are excessive in some cases. A broad zone of 12 to 14 inches, as you can see, southeast Louisiana, south central Mississippi. It does taper as it gets to us, but there could be local amounts of five or six inches over the northwest part of the area. I think on average more like three to five inches. They'll taper to the east, the eastern part of the area, probably getting a half inch to an inch or an inch and a half. Right now, we don't have that problem. On the WVTM 13 Live Doppler, we're currently dry. Your 12-hour forecast indicating pretty tranquil conditions tonight, down to 76 by 11 overnight lows in the low to mid 70s. So not too bad a night coming up. Here's our short-term model forecast. We go through tonight, basically rain-free, mostly clear skies, the calm before the storm, you might say. During the day tomorrow, not too bad. I do think we'll see a bit more cloud cover in the afternoon and probably a few stray showers developing tomorrow afternoon. Seven day forecast looking like this. Stray thunderstorm tomorrow and 91. Chance of a storm on Saturday. Rain becomes more likely as we go through Sunday. Tropical showers Monday and Tuesday. Possibility of a few spin up tornadoes in here as well. Then a few scattered storms next Wednesday and Thursday.